25 kilometer radius, or was it based on the assumption that the CIA can? My expectation is that uh, based on the on the uh, amount of chemical weapons in the pit, uh, and on what uh, we've been told about wind patterns in that day, and the disposition of forces, that there could be substantially, uh, there could be a very large number of troops included in a possible uh, cloud area. Well, what, so, another topic? No. Yeah. Uh, can, I just don't think we know at this stage, but I think we have to think in terms of big numbers, bigger than 15,000, certainly. So in the 100,000, right? Well, I don't know. We, we'll have to wait and see. But I think we have to be prepared for the possibility of, of big numbers. And then the question will be, um, uh, what was the uh, uh, level of exposure, if any? Uh, but when we get the model, then we'll, as I say, we'll run the model against our geographical uh, information uh, data of where troops were, and uh, that will give us a sense of, uh, we, we one, have to get an idea of how big the cloud was or the plume, and then two, who was in that area. Yeah, I, I don't know. Um, 